The following segment is sponsored by Credit Karma. The holidays don't need to be filled with added financial stress. With a little planning and strategy, you can enjoy the festivities and gift giving without feeling burdened by debt in the new year. Consumer financial advocate Courtney Alev is here to share some smart and strategic tips to stay on top of spending. We learned something really interesting in a recent Intuit Credit Karma study, which is that 24% of Americans wish that the holidays would be canceled altogether this year because of cost. And if that sounds familiar, I'm here to tell you it does not need to be that way this year. The number one thing that you can do to make sure you don't overspend this holiday season is to be realistic about what you can spend. Set a limit. How do you do that? Take a look at what money you've got coming in, what's going out, and see how much is left over that you can put towards the holidays. If there's not much left over or none at all, see if there's any areas of your spending where you can cut back to make some cushion. But whatever the spending limit is that you decide to set, it's important that you stick to it. Once you've got that spending limit, it's time to make a plan. It is so easy to wait until the last minute. I know I've been running around on Christmas Eve certain years trying to buy gifts, but not only is that stressful and not fun, you're probably going to end up spending more than you need to spend because you'll miss out on deals or discounts. As part of that plan, make a list. Check it twice. Keep checking it. Keep it on you, in your pocket, or on your phone. That can make it much easier to resist impulse buying, which is so common for many of us at this time of year. And it helps you do your research. Once you've got that list, you can see what the best deals and discounts available to you on those purchases might be. Spending a few minutes to do your homework can really pay off. Travel can be one of the biggest expenses over the holidays. If you're planning on traveling this holiday season and have not booked yet, it's a good time to start doing your research. Set up some Google flight alerts so you can see how prices are trending for your dates and destinations. And see if there's a way you maybe can save money by traveling on an off day, like a Tuesday or a Wednesday versus a weekend. Or you can get more creative. My friend's family celebrates Thanksmas. They travel to get together in between Thanksgiving and Christmas, so they save a lot of money on expensive holiday flights. While the number one mistake many people make over the holidays is not planning in advance, another big one is not talking to each other about financial stresses. If you're stressed about the holidays, you are not alone. 22% of Americans this year feel like they cannot afford gifts. So if you're nervous about the holidays, have a conversation with your loved ones. Sit down, share that spending limit, and brainstorm creative ways that you can save money. Maybe everyone picks one name out of a hat this year versus buying gifts for everyone. Maybe you set a small spending limit, or you do something free or exchange baked goods. That can really help alleviate the stress. For more information, download the Credit Karma app. Wherever you are on your personal financial journey, we have tools, tips, and resources that can help you.